Hey guys, so today I'm gonna show you how to change the CPU in a computer motherboard. I'm gonna take out a CPU from one motherboard and transfer to another motherboard. Here's the motherboard, not we're gonna take out the CPU. Make sure that you unplug the uh, power from the PC. I remove the CPU fan panel. Then use a fat blade screwdriver. You know, insert into where the heatsink push pin is, and turn into the uh, L direction. Lift the push pin up Then remove the CPU heatsink Here you see the CPU with its uh, retainer. You can see the old thermal page is still on the CPU, which we need to clean up. Here's the top view of the CPU heatsink and the bottom of the CPU heatsink, which you can see the four push pin and the old thermal page in the middle. Here I remove the latch that holds the CPU retainer down. After that, open the retainer up. Remove the CPU out of the socket and hold by the CPU edge. I place the CPU on an anti-static bag to clean the old thermal paste from underneath the uh, CPU heatsink. I just use a uh, tissue. To clean the uh, dust uh, between the uh, CPU heatsink and uh, also some dust between the fan, I use the uh, Q-tips. To clean the old thermal paste from the CPU, I just hold the CPU on the edge and use a tissue to slowly scrub away the old thermal paste. After clean out the old thermal paste, now I'm gonna place the CPU into the new motherboard. Make sure to align the CPU notch to the socket notch. Close the CPU retainer down. Then close the latch. Now time to put the CPU heatsink back. Have the push pin in a closed position as so. If you see the black push pin is sticking out, then what you can do is uh, pull the, the bottom where you have the uh, the turning knob, pull it uh, out 
and then the uh, black push pin will be retracted. For the CPU thermal paste, I'm using Arctic MX4. Place a small mount in the middle of the CPU. Place the CPU heatsink on top of the CPU. Make sure you align the four push pin into the four hole on the motherboard that's around the CPU. It should look like this. Push the CPU push pin down. You should hear a sound that okay, the push pin has you know, gone to the hole and uh, screw it. Afterwards, you can try to grab and uh, remove the CPU heatsink and you can find it uh, where it fastly screwed to the motherboard. So now plug back the CPU pin now and plug back other cable that you disconnect including the power core which now you connect back to the PC. So let's turn on the PC by pressing the power button. That's great that the CPU fan is running. From the BIOS posting, we can see that our newly installed CPU works. CPU Core i7-2600. Thank you for watching this video. I hope the tutorial is helpful for you to remove the CPU and able to install it back. Either you change the CPU to another motherboard or you could be just uh, changing the thermal paste. Click a like if you like the video, subscribe if you're not subscribed yet, and I'll see you next video. Bye!